God made a boundary between light and darkness, history, what is the reason for the light? If they say, God created angels as living, pure, and prophetic creatures. The angels asked, what are we? And where did we come from? Who created us? Or do we say we are self-created? Because God had created the devil above all else, the devil heard them say this from below, he thought to say I have created you. The devil didn't find a voice from above saying, I have created you, the devil didn't just think but he told them, I have created you. At that time, his parties were divided into three, there were those who doubted, and there were those who believed, there are those who say that you created us, but we created you. Those who doubted are left in the air, those who said yes you created us, have descended into this world. Those who said, what? You created us. No we created you. They descended together. At that time terror persevered among angels. So he can say, and they were made quiet by the word. Saint Gabriel said, let's stand in our purity until we receive our creator and he confirmed it. He said, a good patriot of the army who won today, persevere with the faith you have and ordered them to not change. This is what made Saint Gabriel receive blessing from God. Like this, so he can say, it was heard his scream about Miriam, after that they finished, without denying he said, let it be light, and God created the light for them. This knowledge was revealed, made known to them and they praised him as holy, 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 commentary, if they say why did he create the seven in silence and the light in speech. When he says, it is possible to create in silence and in speech. The heretics say it is impossible to create that way. It must be in silence not in speech or it's in speech not in silence. They say this in order to destroy the purpose. Since there were no heavenly angels then, he created the seven in silence. But now that there are angels who are heavenly, he created the light through a speech. Just to David say in Psalm 15, To he who walks with integrity and practices righteousness, who speaks the truth from his heart. Even if it is so, they will say, Why did God create darkness before and the light after? If he had first created light and then created darkness he would have been a good God. To destroy the purpose the heretic would say, if God had created light, it was said that an evil God would have created darkness. If Almighty God first created light and then darkness, would it be possible to say that if God created light, then evil God created darkness? It is the custom of the Lord to bring it later, to destroy this world that passes before, and to inherit the eternal kingdom of heaven. Let's say that he made the Old Testament that will pass away and then made the gospel that will not pass away. But other people take this and say that he created eight creatures on this day, but in the book of Jubilee, they will be content with this, because God says that he is a relative. However, in the book of Jubilee it says that God created seven relatives and by this evidence they are defeated. This light is not, unique from the seven. It is to reveal what was hidden by the nature of fire, so that they can reveal the smothered fire with straw. If they say in what language did he create this world, he created it in Syrian language. In the Syriac language, God means the God who created the 22 creations, and in other words he created it in the Hebrew language, to make this known, God spoke to Abraham and said to Abraham in the language of his creation.